Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Now this is the lecture number seven on uh, three phase induction motors. Or yahan se ab jo series lectures ke start ho rahe these are the most important lectures on induction motors. Uh, so we are going to talk about an equivalent circuit diagram of induction motor. Jis mein sabse pehle hum log three phase induction motor ke stator se apni equivalent diagram ko start karenge so we have comparison ke liye maine ek transformer three phase transformer draw kiya hua hai aur yahan pe aapke paas ek three phase induction motor ka stator hai now this is the core of the stator and here we have the core of transformer transformer banane ka purpose ye hai ki aap logon ne pehle transformer ki equivalent diagrams ko samjha hua hai now you can see that ke in dono diagrams mein we have a three phase system jisme aapke paas va vb and vc these are the three source again uh, induction motor mein we have va and we have vb and here we have vc now these are the three input sources uh, making a three phase थ्री फेज एकमेंट अब इन दोनों में फ़र्क क्या है कि अगर आप ट्रांसफार्मर की बात करें तो यहाँ पर आपके पास जो फ्लक्स जनरेट होगा दैट विल बी मूविंग ये वाइट लाइन्स जो अब मैं रेड से बनाता हूँ उसको दिस विल मूव इन दिस डायरेक्शन और जो ये मूव करेगा इन दिस वे सो ऑल द फ्लक्स दैट विल प्रोड्यूस बाई दीज थ्री coils va from va source vb source and vc source are in same direction whereas jo aapke paas uh, three phase induction motor mein winding place hai place ki hui hai this is 120 degree out of uh, phase for example va jo aapke paas yahan pe draw kiya gaya hai iske 120 degree displacement pe aapke paas you have second phase now you have third phase that is 120 degrees displaced from the uh, b phase uh, important baat ye hai ke jo aapke paas transformers mein magnetic field produce hoga that will be linear magnetic field whereas the magnetic field that will be produced in state in three phase induction motor stator that will be revolving magnetic field so you have north pole and you have south pole that will be rotate in this direction and the direction and the speed of rotation is taken out with the relation that we have ns is equals to 120 f by p ye sari baat batane ka purpose ye hai ki aapke paas jo transformer aur stator hai इसकी इक्वलेंट डायग्राम दैट विल बी सेम हम कभी भी किसी भी मैग्नेटिक क्वांटिटी को इलेक्ट्रिकल क्वांटिटी में जब कन्वर्ट करते हैं तो यू वर्क विद ओनली सिंगल फेज डायग्राम एक फेज पे काम किया जाता है सो वी विल कंसीडर अ सिंगल फेज वोल्टेज वी ए सो स्टार्टिंग फ्रॉम ट्रांसफार्मर वी हैव अ इनपुट सोर्स वी से दैट दिस वी ए देन यू हैव रजिस्टेंस ऑफ द कॉयल दैट यू say that this is r1 then you have a leakage reactance you say that this is jx1 and you have a magnetizing branch jo is core ne magnetize hone now this is a core and here you will be having magnetizing branch and that will be the responsible for eddy current and hysteresis loss and you have this r0 and you have the other reactance and you will say that this is j x not and after this whole assembly aapke paas jo a quantity produce hoti hai this will be called as e1 now this is the same diagram for three phase induction motor stator whereas this r1 can be represented by rs stator resistance and this jx1 can be represented by jxs stator reactance 
R0 and JX0 will remain as same and this will give you the no load current. जो uh, current आपके पास यहां से गुजरेगा इसको आप लोग कहेंगे I1 stator current or sometimes it is also called as IS. Again that will be the stator current. Uh, there are two voltage drop components in this diagram. Aap consider karein, uh, again for this stator, you have this VA. You have this VA source, jo current is missing, that will be IA. Or uske baad, this current is passing through this coil. And here you have a coil, jo aap ki ek winding ho Again, the winding have some resistance. So you will have a voltage drop in terms of I1, R1 and you have the second uh, voltage drop that will be in leakage directness. Now leakage directness transformer ke case mein kya thi? Ke aapke paas jo main flux that is passing through this core if this escapes from this core so this will be the leakage flux. Or uh, transformer ke case mein aapke paas wo flux jo is core mein reh jayega that will be the leakage flux whereas the flux that pass that uh, passes through this air gap and enters in the core and again passes through the uh, air gap and that is the useful flux and we will say that this is magnetizing flux and this is very important important kyun hai kyunki yahan se define hoga the no load current of transformer and no load current of three phase induction motor stator jo aapke paas transformer mein no load current hota hai that is only 2 to 5 percent of i full load whereas in induction motor you have 50 to 60 percent of the full load current this is more because the flux passes through the air gap and enters in the rotor. This air gap the flux pass it needs more electric power. And this has two air gaps. And this flux when air gap cross the stator and it will complete its pa pass through this core and goes back in this way. ये आपके पास जो फ्लक्स का है फ्लक्स का है वो पाथ होगा अगेन मैं इसको रेड से ड्रा करता हूं इट विल पास थ्रू कोर एंड कंप्लीट इट्स पास पाथ थ्रू दिस कोर एंड मूव बैक टू इन दिस डायरेक्शन सो इट नीड्स मोर अमाउंट ऑफ एनर्जी के जो आपका ये फ्लक्स है वो एयर गैप से पास करे सो so सेकंड आपके पास जो वोल्टेज ड्रॉप कंपोनेंट आता है इन इंडक्शन मोटर वो आता है इन टर्म्स ऑफ J I1 X1 नाउ दिस इज द लीकेज रेक्टस अब जो ओवरऑल इक्वेशन आपके पास बनेगी यू प्रोवाइडेड इनपुट वोल्टेज दैट वाज V1 इज इक्वल्स टू I1 R1 प्लस J I1 x1 plus e1 whereas this e1 is a emf of the stator is lecture ke liye bahut zaruri hai ki aap log transformer ke equivalent diagram ko zehen mein rakhein agar aapke zehen mein wo equivalent diagram hogi तो आप लोगों को ये इंडक्शन मोटर की केवलेंट डायग्राम बहुत सानी से समझ आ देगी। अदरवाइज थोड़ा सा आपको देखना पड़ेगा। सो uh, फॉर so हमने जो केवलेंट डायग्राम बनाई, दिस इज़ द केवलेंट डायग्राम ऑफ़ द स्टेटर, जिसमें अभी तक रोटर का कोई पार्ट इंक्लूडेड नहीं है। दिस आर ऑल Stator side quantities VA is the input voltage to the stator. I1 is the stator current, sometimes called as IS. E1 is the EMF produced in the stator. Uh, 
इन नेक्स्ट लेक्चर हम रोटर की क्वांटिटीज़ को देखेंगे एंड वी विल कंप्लीट आवर एक्वेलेंट सर्किट डायग्राम थैंक यू वेरी मच